I was on holiday in Nashville, vacation, as you guys would say, and uh, I was in a coffee shop, and uh, Carly was still behind me in, in the queue, in the line, again, as you guys would say, and um, I was trying to order an English breakfast tea, which you guys don't really do over here. It's uh, a, bit, a bit troublesome for me to get English breakfast tea often, and they did not have it on this instance, and I don't drink coffee, so I didn't know what to get, so I, I got all panicky, kind of like a Hugh Grant moment in a movie, when I was all bumbling. And, just like that. Yeah, just like that. So um, Carly jumped in and saved me, because she was behind me in the line, and uh, it, it was starting to back up. It was getting a little embarrassing, but I hadn't noticed. Um, so Carly jumped in and said, this is the tea I get, why don't you try this? So uh, I said, great. So we ordered a couple of herbal teas, and we sat down, we had tea together, and we, we hung out for a couple of hours. And, uh, the tea was terrible, but the conversation was great. So, you know, you win some, you lose some, right? Um, so we, we bonded over all sorts of things, life, music, the Beatles. I made LA to pick a younger brother up from school, but I think he's forgiven me at this point. Um, we hung out like that whole trip, I was here for a few weeks. We hung out together, we wrote songs together. I went back to the UK and uh, I made some demos of those songs and sent them back to Carly and I said, you know, here you go, check these out. She said, she said, I love these, let's be a duo. And I said, great, let's be a duo. What about that ocean in, in between us? You know, we'll figure it out, we see. So uh, we did, but it took about two and a half years for me to get my visa. Uh, and when I did get my visa, we were over here. That's when we finally started dating, which is what led us to where we are now. We've been married for four and a half years at this point. Very good, very, very good. Um, so all that to say is uh, we were friends first, then we were bandmates. It was only a long way down the line that we finally became lovers. So we wrote this song, this is our autobiographical love song, it's on our EP, we have CDs out here, you can find it online, to stream, all that good stuff. Um, this goes out to anybody who was friends, before they were lovers, this one is called Love You Like a Lover.